In this GTA Online DLC video, I'm going to be completing the entire Operation Paper Trail missions for the IAA, and we're going to see how much money we are going to make from doing that. Now, for this week and this week only, being the first week that this DLC released, this mission is going to be double money and double RP, but I'm just interested to see myself how much money overall will this bring. So without further ado, let's just jump into it. As you can see in the top right, it is double Double money, double RP. We're gonna put this on hard for fun. All right, let's get into it. ULP intelligence. Wow, I'm becoming a good guy now. I just swore myself into the Constitution of the United States. This is incredible. I'm a good guy now in GTA. Right. We are a good guy now. We need to go to the apartment. All right, so we're going to San Andreas Avenue. There's a guy getting out of his car right there. I don't know why, but anyways, let's just go inside of his apartment. Wow, nice place you got here. Dude, why can't I run in here? I seriously doubt that this guy is just chilling out in here. All right, I found the computer. All right, let me just let me just do my hacking really quickly. Well, that was easy. We have two targets. All right, FBI are making a deal with the Duggins for four pieces of hardware. I gotta get two from each of these spots. Okay, maintenance outfits can be used to access the FIB HQ without raising suspicion. I do see that on the map, so I'm gonna go and get that. All right, yep, let's just change clothes right here. All right, yeah, looks good to me. All right, all right, so I've made it to the FIB building. Now let's 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 go in. Let's see what's up. All right, I got one thing of hardware. Thank God, it was in that freaking bin. Oh, I found it. I where? Where did I find it? It's okay. It's okay. Whatever. I don't even know where I found it. I know it's in that room. Maybe it was on the table somewhere. I don't know. I'm at the FIB site right here. I have to find the fuse box. I don't know where that is. Oh, I ran right by it. So what did I do? All right, yeah, okay. So that's disabled. Wait, there's two fuse boxes? What? They're really high maintenance. I said they were high maintenance. These are really high maintenance. There's another fuse box on top of the building. There it is. Literally right here. Oh my gosh. Screw y'all. I'm just. I'll just shoot an RPG at it, and then uh, I don't care if my cover's blown at this point. Anyway, it's dark. Oh, here's the headphones. All right, so I got everything. There we go. Uh, this one was pretty easy. All right, so now we just got to leave the FIB Depot, which I'm doing just straight up in the dark because I don't care. And we got to deliver it to drop off, and boom, there we go. All right, we made it to drop off, and boom, just like that. That was a very smooth drop off. And there we go. We have just passed our first mission. And we gained 48,000 right there. All right, now we gotta do the mission called Counterintelligence. Hack the drones using SecuroServe hacking app to locate the base of operations. Okay, so this, this drone is in motion right now. I don't know how close I have to get to this. Oh, I have to like get pretty close. All right, so we hacked that drone, that's fun. So let's go to the other drone. All right, so I made it to this drone. Let me just hack the crap out of it really quickly. All right, we just hacked both drones. Now what do we gotta do? Oh, why? Why is someone running drones from a motel? That's so interesting, but all right, let's go to a motel, I guess. All right, let's go to this motel. Just casually walk in. Why is no one here? Wait, what the heck? Get out. Dude, I'm right next to the door. Oh my gosh, you bomb. All you had to do just open the door. Where am I? What the heck? Defuse the bomb. Okay, I guess I'm hacking the bomb. Oh god. Oh, I hate this so much. I remember when Doomsday had this. This is so annoying. Alright, I got that one, Lord. Oh, okay, that's it. Whew. I completed a hack. Now deliver the van to the drop off i shall do that so let's just and let's just get in the driver's seat here and um let's pretend like none of this just happened all right so i lost the cost finally i'm almost at the drop off so i think all i have to do is just drop this off and boom we're done and voila here's your van and there we go we passed this mission also uh we got another forty-eight thousand for that all right so we'll to go to Agent Johnson's Garage, all right? All right, so I've made it to Agent Johnson's Garage. So, I don't know what I'm doing here. I wasn't really listening. What the? 
Wait, that was it? I, I just punched a hole right in her freaking window. All right, so I made it to the first GPS location. Um, okay, Agent Johnson's not here. Oh, are you kidding? If I would have known that's where the other two locations were, I would have gone to there first. Oh, my lord. So there's definitely something going on here. They all seem to be shooting each other. So I'm just gonna ignore them and just search for Agent Johnson. All right, I found Sarah. Let me just, let me kill these people right in here. All right, can we get in this vehicle? Oh my God, we can. Get in, get in, get in. You need to get in. Let's get out of here. Oh, that was so smart. Oh my gosh, Agent Johnson feeling a little bit sick, I guess. We can take her to the hospital, that's great. There you go, get out. All right, there we go, we finished that, thankfully. How much did I get there? Tw Why did I only get 24,000 for that one? All right, agent seizure. All right, so who are we seizing? All right, I made it to the first location. I have an idea. I've been doing this one for a little bit now. Um, I'm just thinking, can't I just grenade launch or some of this? This is getting annoying. I don't know. I don't understand how this is not even in the signal jammer. Let me drive up the road a little bit further and try. All right, can I can I shoot this RPG at it? I do not want to fight. God. Oh, I got it. That, <laughs> all right, that is annoying to do. But can I just shoot like an RPG like right here? Oh, that worked. Oh, that saved a lot of time. I was having issues trying to get that one too. Oh, uh, last attempt. By the way, this is not my first attempt. This is probably getting close to my 10th attempt. This is pro I'm thinking this might be one of the dumbest missions in GTA Online. This specific mission right here. The other missions haven't been too bad. What? Oh, we got it. I think we started a fire. I think that's technically what happened. All right, so we have two more signal jammers to go. It's like right there, maybe? Okay, I got it. it. Oh, it was behind here. Are you kidding me? Let me just put a sticky bomb down. Let me get out of here. All right, that's all the signal jammers now. So what I'm gonna have to do is steal the van. Oh, never mind. I was just talking so much crap. I literally just did it. Sweet. All right, cool. All right, and we have made it to the drop off. Oh my gosh, that was probably the dumbest mission in GTA Online. There's, there's no doubt about that. That was so, so stupid. At least we get 48,000 instead of the 24,000. All right, here we go. We're doing Operation Paper Trail. All right, there's Mason Duggan. Yep, there he is. There's his briefcase. We're gonna have to go all the way up there stealthily. All right, so essentially I just go get that guy, you know, pretty quick and easy, right? So pew, pew, very nice. Now there's a drone flying, which you can barely see, but I somehow hit it. Oh, that guy, oh, okay. That guy had the key card, but there's a guy on the map that will see you, so. We're gonna have to take care of that really quickly. We're gonna we're gonna have to go right here and pew and kill his little kill his best friend. All right, and then we're gonna go inside the elevator and start going up. Okay, okay, I think I've done this finally, fully stealthily. Oh my lord. All right, we got it. We got it. Oh, it doesn't even matter. We were going to have to do this. Oh my god. We were going to have to do this non stealthily. Okay, is that everyone? Why do I feel like it's not everyone? Oh, that is everyone right here. Okay. Looks like a guy right there. Yeah, okay, good. That is That was the guy we needed to kill. Dude, there's so many guards up here. I can't do anything. Okay, I have to go after him. But at the same time, I'm about to die. We have to go and track down Mason Duggan, which is going to be a fun time. So let me get in my personal vehicle and let's just start going after him. All right, I think that's all the guards. I think all left this time is just Mason Duggan. And there we go. I just killed Mason Duggan. I have the briefcase. And let's just deliver it off to the drop-off. All right, we have 
finally completed that mission. That took so long. Really? Only 28,800? Alright, here we go. This is the final mission. So, alright, so we've made it to Mount Chiliad. Alright, let's go to the silo hat. And let's get down in here and let's figure out what is we're gonna have to do. Um, okay. So, we get no light. That's fun. Just to replace fuses. That was so dumb. I, oh my god, that one fuse, I spent like 10 minutes trying to find one fuse, and it was literally stuck in a corner where I could barely fit. That was terrible by GTA. That is absolutely terrible. I found all four fuses now. Okay, this thing's still, oh, it's working. So what I'm doing now is I'm wiping out this entire room of any juggernauts. I remember when I was on that manhunt just to try to find that fuse, there was one, there's one juggernaut all the way up front. So I just assume we're gonna have to go all the way back through here and try to escape out this way. All right, let's go into the server room. Oh my God, I literally just ran into one. Okay, I might have left like one juggernaut or something. Hopefully one wouldn't be bad at all. All right, so can we escape out of here now? Okay, so we made it out of there. I am pretty bruised up, as you can see. You probably won't see it just because it was just kind of boring me shooting some guys or whatever. Oh my, look how bloody I am. Escape Mount Chiliad, but there is a helicopter flying after me being annoying. Okay, well, that should solve that problem. All right, let's go to the IA facility and let's just finish this off. This is getting dumb. All right, let's go to the IA facility. Are we done? All right, so we passed the final heist. Uh, we got $38,400 out of that. It was not great money, honestly. Okay, wow, those missions actually did not do that much in GTA Online. I, I think I barely made over like 200,000. Make sure you check out this video right here if you wanna see me spend $20 million in GTA Online in the new Criminal Enterprise DLC.